Let airstrikes like this one on ISIS chip away at a network of systematic murder. Refugees who barely escaped Iraq with their lives are sharing their stories of religious persecution with 10 News. Hey, we're honored tonight at a charity event in Coronado. And 10 News reporter Candace Crohn is live at Hotel Del Coronado where those refugees shared some pretty powerful experiences, Candace. That's right. One of the teens who spoke here tonight told the crowd that he witnessed his friends get killed in an explosion. And the stories were just unbelievable. And the teens hope that they encourage other refugees back home to never lose hope. You know, if I haven't left Iraq, I would have been dead. Levi Kina came to the U.S. from Iraq seven years ago. He says his family was one of many forced out by terrorists because they were Christian and his father worked for Americans. We got a letter in our backyard saying if we don't evacuate our house, um, we like our house would have gone bombed and they would have kidnapped my dad basically. Kina is one of eight young refugees who came to San Diego County to start over. Part of their journey involved being a part of a mentorship program put on by the nonprofit Roads of Success. The teenagers shared their experiences at a fundraiser for the organization Saturday, where they were honored for working toward their goals in the face of adversity. With the Iraqi crisis going on today, there's so many new kids that are going to be coming in and they're going to be lost unless they have the right mentorship. Volunteers with Roads of Success reached out to city and county leaders, including Supervisor Ron Roberts, who mentored one of the teams aspiring to be an architect like Roberts. To the extent that we can broaden the horizons for each of these young people, give them all the options, let them choose what they really want to do. And that's what I tell him. As the violence in Iraq continues, these teens watch and hope their stories serve as inspiration that despite the odds, never give up on your dreams. It's a line of opportunity and I came here to get my opportunity and finish my studying and become a dentist. Now, tonight's event also featured an anti-bullying campaign. Motivational speaker Nick Vujicic with Life Without Limbs was also a guest speaker. We're live in Coronado tonight. Candace Crone, 10 News.